All right, everybody, welcome back to Bearded Drums. In today's episode, we close out the little series that we have been doing on kind of the ultimate or very lightweight travel rig for playing gigs. So over the past three videos, I have tried to come up with a little lightweight gigging rig that I could get into and out of the gig in one load. That was kind of the stipulation for myself. So the first thing we looked for was a quality cymbal bag. Then the next video covered a good quality lightweight hardware set. And in last week's video, we looked at a very small compact kit, the Pearl Midtown. And now to close out this entire series, we have to obviously be able to get all of this gear in and out of the gig in one load very easily, which brings us to today's product, which is this right here. This is the Rock and Roller Micro Multi-Cart. This is the smallest cart that they make. This ran me $109 off of Sweetwater. And for what this cart does for me, that is a really, really good price. You could probably find something a little cheaper, maybe at Lowe's or Harbor Freight but I would really suggest you look at this option. I bought the cheap cart from Harbor Freight. It lasted all of a month. I've had this cart for right at a year now. It works perfectly. Nothing has come loose. It looks as good as the day I bought it, and I've gotten more use out of this cart, not just for drums, going on vacations, moving stuff around the house. Every time I need to carry a heavy load and I don't necessarily want to carry it, I use this cart and it has served me well, like I said, for a year now. And as I mentioned, this is the micro version. This is the smallest cart that Rock and Roller makes. There is a mini, there is what's called, I believe, a mid, and then there is the max. So you have like four models, very small, small, a mid weight, and then the max size. So even after watching these series of videos, if you're not like me, you don't necessarily want to get in in one load or you have a large drum set, five or six piece kit, you can just buy the bigger cart to fit it all in one load. Or if you wanted to go with the micro, it would just take you maybe two, possibly three loads. And as you saw when I held up the cart, you know, it's only about this big. It doesn't weigh that much. The best thing about this cart, as opposed to just buying a cart from Lowe's or something, it folds up so small, it goes into the back of the car or truck very easily. I've never had an issue with this adding way more space to my loadout than the actual loadout itself. The whole thing is really built well, and there are other models of these carts that have bigger, like all-terrain type tires, though I've never had an issue with the small plastic wheels on this. Um, it has locks for the wheels. There is uh, a kind of a sandpaper-like material that is on the bottom rails, so whatever you put on the cart is not necessarily going to slide around. A really great value, and what I'm going to do now, and really the only thing to do, is I'm going to take you into the drum room, and we are going to put my entire gigging rig on this kit so you can see how much the micro can hold. So let's hop over to the drum room. All right, so here we are with the cart, and this is just so you can see how small the cart will go if you just have a few things you need to put on there. But, as I said, you can extend just by loosening this, tightening these little wing nuts, and that is how large the cart will be fully extended. Um, so everything is here that I use on a normal gig. Cymbals, full drum kit, all of my mics and accompanying gear, hardware, my fan, everything. And I'm going to show you how all of this will fit on this tiny little cart. And keep in mind, this is the smallest model. So everything will fit on here and I can get into the gig one load. So we'll start. We've got, as mentioned in the previous video, we've got our mono cymbal bag. Put that right there. This is my case for my in-ear setup. That's gonna go right there. This is my big microphone and cable case. This carries everything I could ever need, no matter the size of the gig. It's got every mic I've ever needed, big and small gigs. That's gonna go right there. Next, 
is going to be the DW hardware kit. Fits on there very easily. Then we've got our matching mono stick bag that slides right down in there just like that. <clears throat> One thing I did forget is a snare drum. So now we have a snare drum. We'll stick that right there. Now all we have left is just a few pieces. First thing I'll put on there is going to be the pearl bag that contains all of the toms and the snare. That's one bag for that. Then I've got the bass drum for the pearl kit. That fits right in there. Got the seat for the throne. And I've got my fan. Um, and actually, I could, if I wanted to, fit one more thing on there. Most of the gigs I play are carpeted, but sometimes, you know, you play places that don't have carpet, so you want to bring your own rug. So that's it. I've got a full setup with everything I could possibly need on this one cart. And as I said, this the whole point of this was to be able to get into the gig with one load. So if it doesn't fit on this cart, I don't bring it in. And the cart has no problem fitting all of this weight. I've never seen it kind of buckle underneath or bend. Um, I really have had good luck with this cart. And as you can see, I'm in the gig in one load. So there is the Rock and Roller Multi-Cart, the micro version. Um, as I said before, there are other sizes, so if you need something bigger, you can go look online. The prices really aren't bad. This one was 109 Serves me very well. So that's going to conclude our little mini-series on a lightweight gigging rig. One load in, one load out. If you like this video, toss me a thumbs up, and if you like this style of content, consider subscribing to the channel. Thanks again for checking out the video, and as always, I'll see you on the next one.